<laughs> so that was Dr. Vox with uh, Death. It's a good name for a song from the Argo Fox YouTube channel. You can see the URL for it right there on the screen. And uh, I was just looking at the uh, locked achievements for pit people. One of them's a little suspect because it says play the game for at least 0 0.01 seconds, which obviously I've done. But there's others that are just wonderful, like dream a not so little dream, which says dream up something marvelous. Language, learn a foreign language. And you're thinking, maybe these are things that you do in the game with side quests or something. But then there's other ones like uh, vote, vote in a local election in your own physical hometown. Pterodactyl, make pterodactyl sounds when you're completely alone. And woodchuck, determine how much wood a woodchuck would chuck if it could. So, yeah, that's a thing. Anyway, let's play Pit People. It's a little, this book will change your life. Yep. Not to be confused with This Book is a Dungeon, which is an interesting little art piece of a game. Alright, so we are going to now take the Jerk Dome up into the stratosphere to fight the giant space bear, which is possessed by a stovepipe hat demon. Maybe we'll even buckle our pants. Kill 35 enemies in battle, recruit three fighters. Yeah, I'm not doing that. We're just we're just going on to the end. Warning, space bear. With stars for nipples. Never forget that part. I don't think I need Okay, I can go with my current party. Excellent. The bear. Yes, that one. Now go save Hansel. Alright, let's grab a couple healing camps. I don't think I'll need them. Don't need the cage. Let's story quest. Buckle your pants. Bucka bucka your pants. Yep. <laughs> Thank you for resubscribing. Let's kick a little ass. That's three months of support from our own. AKA Hailing. There we go. Time to take the jerk dome into space. So apparently I didn't have to walk to it. And now it landed over here. Which means, oh. Oh, now that's just asinine. Not only do we have to walk to it, we have to walk to it in a completely unknown spot. That's why they call it the Jerk Dome, I guess. Gotta have those emotes, right? Them truck, 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 trucks. You got it, save it. Hey, they walk on it. Whoa, this is the crawl of him. You want me? What is You got it. Hey, yeah, that's right. I'm getting all these coins over here. That's a lot of trucks. I guess that's honey. No, can't go through it. But it is honey because there's bees in it. That's how you can tell if it's honey, you know, in real life. If there's bees in it, it's definitely honey. If there's no bees in it, it is not honey. Don't let them fool you. Here we go. All right, we got Gluten, Crackle, Yosef, Horatio, and Pipistrella. That's why there's so much clover honey out there. Ah, see? Yeah. Warning, completing this quest will exit this world map. 
people got icky eating bees. Every time. Oh, you decided to come after all. Still interested in saving your kid, are ya? I ran the numbers, and it's almost definitely not worth it. I'm not saying it's 0%, but it's very nearly 0%. Also, are those annoying people friends of yours? Helmetites! What are you doing here? We found you at last, Princess Pipistrella! We're here to fight! Ugh. Haven't you learned anything? Helmetor was just hiding behind that big helmet. Yes, we know! We all were! But no longer! We said we're here to fight! By your side! They were all budgies. That was my wife being terrified. You probably could hear that. Oh, well, yeah, that's okay. Hey, us and some other guys are coming along too. We ain't seen nobody bust up chalk like that before. <laughs> you guys made it just in time for the best part. Hope you're ready for a rumble. Look, I don't know what you idiots are planning, but this is as far as I'm flying today. Oh, that's fine. We'll take it from here, right, Sophia? Wait, what? Prepare to set sail! When I close my eyes, I can't see. Papa? This is beautiful. Thump. Landed on the bear. I repeat. Is everyone okay? Yeah, I think we made it. Well, sort of. We just need to get his attention somehow. Then, while he's distracted, you can save Hansel. Um, if I was a space bear, what would get my attention? There are bear traps on this bear. Ah, that is looking shiny and breakable. Of course, his his star pasties. It is, isn't it? Wouldn't want anyone smacking the stars on my body. Exactly. Okay, is everyone ready? Woo, let's go full Horatio's family. Well, I'm guessing, with all the shit laying around, our objective is going to be to find our way through all this fur and get over to the stars as quickly as possible. Uh, yeah, we got stuff over here with doors in it. Uh-huh. That means recruits are probably going to be coming out of it like the castle siege. How many stars does Yosef have on his body? How six is seven, my dude? <laughs> Alright, what if... Put Yosef here to burn down some of this fur. Everyone else just has to get out of range. Uh, she can't really get out of range. Alright, everyone just move forward as you can. Ooh, they just knock it down. Alright. 
right, this is... Oh, shit! Of course the first day is caught on fire. Ooh, that's... That's gonna spread. Alright, I wanna send Yosef forward first so we know where other people can stand safely. Step on the bear traps. Yeah, just set up. Okay, that's dynamite. Look out! Get off! And that'll send people flying. No, it didn't do anything. I guess he missed. Mm. This is not... quite as smooth sailing as I'd hoped. Horatio, move here. Joseph can move up this side and he should be safe. Right there, parasites. We don't need any more competition. Competition? What are you talking about? Every day we comb and brush, we pluck and we shampoo, but the bear chooses the little handsome man. He gives the little handsome man the teeny tiny ice and cream. And now you? Just let us take the little handsome man home. We'll be out of your hair soon. You will be out of our hair now. Enough, Horatio. I shall handle this. I declare this purple forest for España, for Horatio, and our queen. Hey, allies, hold them back while we break some stars. You got it, Blueberry Farmer. Alright, flying creatures don't seem to be affected by the bear trap. So that's good. This is tough to get through. Just trying to push our way through this whole thing. Snake lady. It is 
is very exciting. This is this is huge. Oh damn, Horatio's dying over here. Ratio and gluten in the spaces where Horatio can be healed. Means he's doing them backwards, unfortunately. Alright. At the edge of your unbuckled pants. Clearly you weren't listening to the giant space bear possessing demon at the end of the last game. Oh, I thought he was healing the wrong person for a sec. I was worried. Not cool, you guys. Oh, frick. Yeah, that moved some people around. Not as far as I might have hoped. Oh no, gluten, gluten, you can't get out of there, can you? Downhill, there's always that start over. Oh, good, Horatio. You look kind of cool. Remember that meme? I mean, not quite as fresh as that boy, but. Stop it! Oh! Just all itchy. Level up, awesome. Not familiar with this meme. Oh, that was a very specific screenshot of Naruto. Had his eyes uh, pointed in different direction for one, different directions for one frame. And the fan caption was the poorly translated, gee, Naruto, you look kind of cool. It's a very glorious single frame. Alright, everyone keep moving up. Except Yosef. Yosef can stay where he is for the moment. Double kill. Always a happy time. And there 
wears a bearded mushroom with very pretty pigtails. I am okay with this. If I must die, let it be to that mushroom. fire. Not exactly what I was hoping for. Alright, we need to get a few more hits in it quick. out of the way before that happens. Oh, 
least the actually pretty dangerous mushroom person is, is a goner. I like this statue over here that's just marked bear. also don't know its name. I guess so. I mean, no one knew the name of whatever it was. Oh, oh, cut it out, you pieces! That doesn't feel nice or good. <laughs> That's one star down. He seems pretty unhappy about it. Yeah, I think it's working. Uh oh, but before we take out that other star, thanks for helping me save a kid you've never met. None of you guys had to do this. Like, I'd let you solo a whole space bear without me. You gotta have a piece of chog. You got to have a piece of chog, so it's only fair. Kids need their papa, Horatio. We're right behind you. Oh, I was hoping for dialogue from the other two. Oh, man. We gotta break through these lines, like, now. And we're healed. Oh, good. Alright, we've gotta go around the bear traps. Oh, why does a bear have bear traps on it? Yeah, we're just gonna have to punch straight down the middle and burn through this fur. Because there's no way through here, from what I can see except to punch it down. Come to think of it, why are there churches on a bear? Why any of this? Why any of this, I think, actually sums up this game really well. hear that voice? It's clearly the delicious irony. Ah, oh, there's some more dynamite. Not all of the dynamite, but some more dynamite. Oh, there's actually paths through there. Doing good. There we go. Block that shit with your shield. Alright, move in. Move in. Ratio get out of the range of the fire. Salute can move over so they're not tempted to go after you. And Crackle can move in. Oh, 
Oh, what? Oh no, they're coming in behind. And that's a lawnmower. Guys, these villagers are getting rowdier by the minute. We're almost there. Let me push through to the star. Or let's push through to the star. You gotta get out of there quick. That was not a good position to randomly land in. Uh -huh. We got a A baby snack. So that's that's a good start. That won't come back to bite you at all. All right, everyone keep pushing through. All right, you need to sit back and keep these guys distracted. And Yosef needs to... Terrible idea, but it wouldn't be a great idea. Alright, Yosef just needs to move in without doing any damage. Also, Horatio, maybe. Stay back one space so that he can hope to keep this guy distracted. He's gonna get knocked away either. In this direction, though, he might get knocked this way, which is closer to the star. Let's put him where I'd originally planned. Oh, God. Stop! You will not touch the backup generator! The power generator? No, he said backup generator. Do you mean the stars? That's really not what those look like. We know exactly what they look like. Don't make this weird. Crackle's voice is top notch. <laughs> oh, no, they killed the babby snacks. up. Move in. Now let's begin. Uh, Bloom doesn't need to move quite that far. Rather he only be in range of one person. Discomforting. <laughs> Threshold for Gronk has gone up. Yeah, that makes sense. There's some really nasty looking creatures in there. Oh no. I did not mean for her to get completely surrounded. Oh, that was some damage. Ooh. Well, don't that work to my advantage?
run out of range. We got lots of babby snakes now. Which means lots of distractions at the very least. Alright, Horatio, move in. Slowly but surely. I am slowly, and don't call me Shirley. <laughs> oh, this is, this is a tough choice to make. Them all. I like that the bear, or whatever it is, now that we know it's got power generators. I like that it, uh. I lost my train of thought. Ugh. <laughs> I am so absorbed in the proceedings here. Oh, Luton slowed. Keep away from the fire, little buddy. Oh, Joseph's stunned. Alright, we just gotta hack and slash our way in, I guess. Knock a snake right out of her. Oh crap, I can't break through this way. Oh, that's no good. Stuff's appearing. Oh, one kill Luton. Luton is what's keeping us alive. Is that the joke? Is that the joke? That Luton is, is not actually a terrible thing, but people are afraid of it? even when they do not have an actual immune response to it. Is that, is that what we're doing? Because I'm okay with that. Alright, we're almost through the star. Uh, Yosef's gonna die. Oh, the giant air troll is actually not as terrifyingly powerful as I expected. <laughs> All right, this is going okay. All right, gluten levels up. Uh, we're not distracted by you. So Did I just hit something metal? <gasps> it's a bomb! Everyone get down! That's why there was only one space.
You all think you're so innocent and pure and good. Fighting the good fight. Hooray for you, heroes. What did I ever do to you? I never killed anyone, but you did. Oh, how I miss you, honey hug. Oh. I love you, honey hug. I love you, honey kiss. I love you, honey hug. I love you. Can it all make sense now? Shit! All this time I assumed he was possessed by the hat, but no. No, the hat just killed his one true love. Ah, I found you. You're much easier to find when nothing else exists. I am the speckled horse. You freed me. I owe you a wish. What? It can be anything, anything you like. <laughs> and he wished for Icid Creams. <laughs> A thing of beauty. Four games later, we've gone from an alien invasion to the complete death of the planet Earth. Achievement unlocked. Seriously serious. Enjoy your wish. Let's see. Oh, it's Horatio, the humble blueberry farmer, loving father, and the most Hot boring creature on the face of the... Wait, what? What happened? I wasn't paying Daddy, attention. It Wait, what? It worked! Papa? Papa? Yes, Hanzo! Hanzo! Papa? Papa? Quick! Out the back! We have to leave right now! Good. Get out of here, you charming individuals! All right, guys. Here's that juicy family. Wait, where'd they go? Okay. Look out, because there's like a billion pieces of my best friend raining down all over the planet. And I guess there has been for, like, centuries at this point. Pip! I mean, Princess Pipistrella! Um, yes. Aren't you the man who delivers the blueberries? No, I mean, yes, but that's not the point. You and the king are in danger. Danger? Here? My good man, we are perfectly safe in this castle. What? The Helmetites! If you're here when they attack! I don't know why, but Father, I feel like we should trust him. Yes, that's right. Now follow me. I'll explain on the way. Yes, go to her. Save your friends. Don't worry about me. It's only an eternity in space. I have my crossword puzzles. <laughs> I feel so bad for the space bear now. Oh, hello. 
Are we friends? I feel like we're friends. You're not the Broodside Bandit, are you? He told me to meet him at the bridge or else. No, I'm not. Trust me. That guy is a bad friend. I'm a good friend. A good friend? They make those? Well, I'm coming with them. You're almost there. Run! Run like you didn't forget anyone else when you made that wish. Anyone. Alright. Somewhere I can go to find, uh... I guess I'll be finding Yosef next. <laughs> well, hooray for you guys. All your dreams came true. What about my dream? Oh. And Honey Hug is gonna get, get his wish now, I guess. The end question mark. skip video because that implies there's more question mark. Is it going to do anything or do they just want me to hit skip? I'm going to give it a minute. So that was a really good game. I feel like there could have been a few more missions in there for the main story to, to flesh out some characters a bit. But all in all, uh, think that that game is absolutely something that everyone should give a shot. That's Pit People, the sequel to Battle Block Theater and the, uh, the fourth game, I believe, from the Behemoth. And it's amazing how they can just go completely shit crazy and still make something strangely touching in the end. I enjoyed that a lot. I guess we're just supposed to skip it. And here's our treasure. Solar Shield, Berber Shop, Sheer Terror, Comb Patrol, Home Run, NRG Bow, Valhallen, Beardface, Standard, <laughs> it's, a, it's a rocket launcher, Harpoon, Paperweight, Hypochondriac, Middle Classy, Peanut Protector, Is This Vegan, Celery Stock, <laughs> it's a pizza, Obsid Celery Stock, Obsidian Cutter, Orcs Delight, and a whole bunch of gold. The bear. Everybody's happy. Well, almost everyone. Hello, Sophia. Art thou there? Tis I, your queen. A collect call from the queen, Madra. See, I am here, your grace. Ah, Sophia, my finest recruitador. Hast thou finished exploring in the new world? My journal shall speak of my deeds. Exploration 69, unlocks 151, quests 14, there is a lot more post story content too. I don't think I'm going to stream that, but I may go back to it offline. And here's our home. 
Good stuff. Out of here. Story quest. Got a full team. Let's go get some. Oh, it's starting the story quest over, so it loops back through. So, yeah, that's it. Thanks to everyone for joining me. I've been Katie. This has been Pit People, and it's been a hell of a ride from start to end. I definitely recommend picking up this game, even having just watched me play through the whole thing. I think there's a lot to love. Just save slot unlock pro Oh, unlocking everything. <laughs> I think there's a lot to love here, even if you already know what's going to happen next. So yeah, I don't know what I'm going to be doing next week, but it's going to be something hopefully equally amazing. Let's go over the schedule the next seven days tomorrow's our day off that is for me and my wife at least a date night so y'all can go do something else sunday we got to playing hard west which is another much more serious uh, srpg about cowboys and demons and murder and stuff and also nine barreled shotguns and 14 barreled pistols Monday, we got my wife Christy. We'll be playing, uh, I guess, uh, Player Unknown's Battleground since it looks like uh, Radical Heights is, is closing its doors. Just PUBG. Just PUBG. Tuesday, we got Annie. She will be playing Paladins with community members who wish to join and near Automata, which I think she's also nearing the end of her game. Wednesday, we got, uh, that's our free day. It's been Jackbox a lot lately, and it very well may be again, because uh, y'all seem to like that shit. If you want to join us before Jackbox, well, you, if you got a Mastodon account that we can look at and make sure you're not, you know, garbagey. <laughs> No offense, we know you're a great person, we do. But we have had actual problems with this already and we've only done it a few times. So, if you're a regular, you're welcome to join us. If you've got an open Mastodon account we can look at or we know you from Mastodon, we are, of course, Squirrel Lily at queer.party, then absolutely come and join us. And even if you don't meet those requirements, you are welcome to hang out and participate as an audience member. Thursday, Alice will this time be getting her uh, Lego Dimension stream. She's on the last two levels of the first story mode. She's got lots more to build and lots more to play. There's tons of content even after that's over. Friday is uh, back around to me and whatever I'll be doing. So once again, thanks for joining us. I hope you'll hit that follow button. Uh, that'll help you keep track of us, and it'll help us keep our metrics high. <laughs> Regardless, thank you so much for being here, and I hope we'll see you again soon. Good night.